Hi, Saints. It's Sister with a Testimony. I'm uh, still enjoying whoo, the beautiful sunshine. You can see it right there. Um, I like the way this camera filters. The Saints, I was finishing up prayer time uh, talking with Bishop Chancellor and um, I just noticed this three trunked tree and yesterday on our mission and journey and the work that we were sent to do there were three of us praying together and the Lord just he was so clearly speaking to us cordon a three strand cord cannot easily be broken and I know everybody thinks about Father, Son, Holy Spirit, three. God is one. One Lord. There's a trunk right there. One faith. There's a trunk right, right there. The, that faith is in the middle. One baptism. Saints, there are three baptisms for us. There are so many sermons in this three trunk tree. A three fold cord cannot easily be broken. The Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. One Lord, one faith, one baptism. Three glorious trunks coming from the base of one. One Lord, one faith, one baptism. A threefold cord cannot easily be broken. Saints, our one Lord calls us and draws us to the base home base heaven's calling saints our faith he gives each of us a measure of faith and once we have heard from the one that can save us the one that can kill us and send us to hell because no one else can no one can touch you without his permission once he puts his mark on you you're marked you got a decision to make then he gives you that measure of faith you got a decision to make. And then there's one baptism that saves the soul. One. It ain't dunking in water. It ain't speaking in tongues. All those are, although those are two of them, the one that counts is the baptism into the body of Christ. Into Yahshua Hamashiach's name. Getting dunked in water ain't going to save you. Speaking in tongues, interpretation, and every gift in the book is not going to save you if you don't have a personal, close relationship with Yeshua, Hamashiach. Woo! And make him the Lord of your life and be baptized into his body, saints. You will not, you will not make it. He said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. The way, one, the truth, two, and the life, three. No one comes unto the Father except by me, says Yahshua Hamashiach. One Lord, one faith, one baptism. They tell you to make a little confession at the altar, you're clean. But you never forgave anybody, you never repented. He said, bring mm, the meat, the root, mm, the root of the matter, the meat of the matter. Let's put it out, all out on the table. Let's make it clear, saints. Your confession or profession for Jesus Christ without living a lifestyle, a lifestyle of Jesus Christ of Nazareth is my Lord and King and Savior and Master, it ain't going to get you nowhere. You can confess all day. You can profess all day. You can jump up and down. You can shout. You can run around the church speaking tongues. You can sit there like a bump on a log and let people think how holy you are. Man, if we ever, literally ever, just let the Holy Spirit do his job, we're going to be shouting the victory, and we ain't just going to be putting on a show. We're going to know one Lord, one faith, one baptism. There's one God. Of all, and he's over all, and he's in all, and he's through all. 
Everything that he made is beautiful. You can look at a vulture, and if you'd look through God's eyes, you'd see how beautiful he made that vulture with a purpose and with a plan for his destiny. Saints, one Lord, one faith, one baptism. Seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things will be added unto you. One Lord, he calls you to himself. One faith, he gives you a measure of faith to be saved. And you repent, and you say, oh my gosh, you really are one Lord, and I only have one faith. And then at that moment, when you realize that he is the Lord of lords, the King of kings, he is God in the flesh, then you say, Lord, baptize me into your body. And that is when you become a true, regenerated person. The sanctification is a process, saints. You ain't going to get it overnight. You're in the process. And when you realize that one Lord, one faith, one baptism, that threefold cord cannot easily be broken, then you're going to come into a realization, i got to live holy, i got to live separate. I've got to live for the Lord or I'm not going to make it. Saints, Jesus ain't doing it all for you. He did it all on the cross. It is finished. Now it's time for you to take up your cross and bear it. Look at the tree. Yeah, pick up your own cross and bear it. He bore his cross to Calvary. He bore his tree, the stake, to Calvary for you. Now, get out of the church pew and get up and do something for the Lord. Because there's a whole lot of folks sitting in church on every Sunday morning, every Sunday night, every Wednesday, and every time there's camp meeting. And they are going to die and go to hell. And I don't care if you tell me I'm preaching heresy. I'll show you in the Bible. If there's no fruit of the Spirit, I don't care how baptized you are in the Holy Ghost. You, you better have some fruit of the Spirit, which is the sign and the fruit of repentance. Seek ye first the kingdom of God and His righteousness, and all these things will be added unto you. I didn't call you up today post this video to coddle you saints if you've got the way the truth and the life then you've got the answer for mankind's problems go tell someone your testimony i love you i lift you up believer and if you are saved sanctified and filled with the holy ghost you're going to be doing something for jesus because you love him so much you can't not tell other people what he's done for you. You cannot sit idly by if you know you've been truly forgiven, sanctified and washed in the water of the word, filled with his spirit. You cannot sit there and say nothing. You need deliverance. You need prayer. And you need to get with a bunch of people that will sharpen your iron encourage you love you even when you fall saints i didn't tell you you had to be so holy overnight that you just might as well just be translated i said get your bible out and start reading it develop your relationship and get with some people that really do love the lord and aren't just um, having a form of godliness but denying the power thereof from such turn away wake up saints i love you god bless you hey preach it right preach it tight all I can do is plant the seeds. You can reject them or you can receive them. One Lord, one faith, one baptism. Till I see you again. And if I don't, God bless you. I'm going to make heaven. I plead and apply the blood of Jesus over you to hide, protect, and keep you in all your ways. And whom the Son has set free is free indeed. God bless you. I love you. It's Sister with a Testament.